Today I wanted to show you how to test capacitors. This is a little 5 microfarad capacitor. The little 5's right there, indicated there. Not sure if it's going to come through on the camera. But what I have is a fuel piece meter, and you can do this with any meter that measures microfarads. This one has a setting for microfarads. So I'm just setting it there on, on microfarads. And it's pretty simple. A matter of just going one lead to the other. If your system was running a capacitor holds a charge in it even if after it's disconnected. So you want to make sure that after you unplug the unit the machine to discharge your capacitor using your insulated handle screwdriver, you're going to hold the insulated part and bridge the leads with the metal part. Okay, and then for testing the microfarads, we're just going one lead to each side. So we want to measure this and we want plus or minus five degrees. And you really need a good contact to get there. But anyway, here we are, 4.89. And this is, you know, it's very sensitive to the contacts touching it all the way. So you can see when I take it off, even just trying to touch it here, it, it doesn't register. But you really need a good contact all the way across, like so. Anyway, we're 4.89 and this is a 5 microfarad capacitor, plus or minus 5%, so we're good. Of course, this was a brand new one, so just so you understand, that's how to test capacitors.